this is asus ex430 laptop and this laptop condition is very poor and you can see this condition and this is the memory card slot and usb port and this boot condition is very poor and you can see this and due to the battery damage this happened this condition and motherboard condition is not bad there is a no e spot and no battery chemical and this is the battery connector battery connector also broken okay let's see i can fix it or not and this is the condition of our circuit and you can see this here some battery chemical destroy this connector and here is so much junk in this connector this is the condition of the circuit this is the usb and memory card driver and this one is fuse and here is some spare parts it's automatically removed from here this is the usb port connector And I need to replace this port but it does not matter this that happened here is one USB port and memory card slot this one and this is the driver okay without this boot and this laptop will do work perfectly let's open it and see yes and this is not possible to repair this is very tough Keep this, this one. I'll manage it from our local market. See this main circuit. And this is the input voltage, 19 voltage. And let's see here is any short circuit or not. Before I inject the power, I need to check some circuit because of it would be any short circuit. This is. This here. No short, and this one is ground. This one, set this connector, and this one is showing short, it's 30 ohms, and it would be, but this is not directly short. At first, I need to check. I am checking all inductor. Here is an inductor is short or not. No short circuit here. This one is crown. This one no short. This one no. This is and this one work for the process of voltage. So it is here. This one no short circuit. And check here no short. But this one is showing short. What? Short. This side is no short, but oh sorry, and this one touch with this Wi-Fi dongle, and that's the issue. Short. No, here is no short circuit, and you can see this. No short. No. And here is also no physical damage, no liquid damage. This is charging MOSFET. Okay. This said okay. This one is showing short. What? This is okay. This side showing short. This one. This one showing short. And 
battery charging area is showing short. Right? This one, this one also showing short. Measure this most bit and check it. What happened? Maybe this most bit would be short. This one is showing short. You can see this here. What is the number of this? E4 BU. Okay. This is the NCL MOSFET and it would be the short because of better character also broken. You can see this or not. And you can see this. This is the battery connector and this is also broken from here. Maybe they have been an air incident with this. And this is the positive connector. Yes. And maybe this must be going on. Take this here. Short. This one. This one is okay. And this one. This one also okay. Let's open it and check what happened. Measure this and this area and this pin. No short circuit here. And maybe circuit. I hold this pin with the ground. This one is short, this one is not short. And I found this most very short it and this is also open. Okay. Okay, I have another one and send most bit and that's one also work for the battery charging. Let's set up here. This one also and send most bit, okay. This is okay. Let's check it. What happened? Most bit soldering is complete, and let's power up this. Into the power. And power LED clone. Yes. Cooling pin also is spinning. Take some voltage here. What happened? Twenty voltage present. Here is a twelve voltage also present. And here is a twelve voltage present. And this is the battery charging area. Processor also heating. And check this also voltage. One point three volt. And this one 1.2 volt and that in processor bolts is also okay this one for 3.3 and this one for 5 volt everything is okay let's take the display display is working or not laptop is turn on yes asus and please wait and display also working and this was the 50 dollar uh, laptop and I repair it. Okay, viewers, thanks for watching.